Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Flair. Uh, today, got a fish on product review. This is the Thunder Shad. Uh, it's handcrafted and made out of balsa wood. This is a crankbait. This is the model uh, 185, I believe it is. Um, it doesn't say it on the package, I don't think. Um, I've looked for it for a little while, but uh, I went up on their website, and I'm pretty sure it's the model 185. Uh, I think it dives zero to five feet. Um, it says the premium grade balsa wood is, has gamagatsu hooks, stainless steel wire, split ring, and split rings craftsmanship by people who care. Tuning. If your lure is running left slightly, bend the eye to the right. If the lure is r runs right, slightly bend the eye to the left, which is just a uh, typical way to tune your crankbaits. Um, that's not just specifically for this. Um, they just kind of give you a little tip on that. Uh, they're made in the United States, and it's uh, thundershad.com or thundershadcrankbaits.com. Um, so, Fish Hound sent me this one. I'm pretty pumped about it. Uh, I don't know if you guys have seen my recent videos. I was talking about balsa wood on one of them, and I was saying how I'm starting to get into balsa wood crankbaits more than plastic. Um, just because of the action, they're a lot more subtle, and uh, they float, obviously. But they're a little more expensive, but they're, I mean, they're handcrafted. Um, very, very high quality. And uh, I'm glad Fish Hound sent this to me, because um, this one's a little bit more special than uh, what you'd normally find. And I'll show you why. So as you guys can see here, it's kind of a, a little square bill kind of thing, but it's got the coffin bill. Looks like a coffin, that's why they say that. So it uh, deflects a lot better when it runs in versus a square bill, it'll just deflect. If it hits on the side, that little that little cut right there, that'll deflect it out. Uh, the only downside is it's got some pretty small hooks on it. Um, I'll probably upsize them, but other than that, it's pretty sweet crankbait. And I got some, some stats over here. Uh, the body length is 2.55, which I'm guessing that's in inches. Um, uh, oh, it says overall length is 3.20. The weight is 13 grams or 0 .450 ounces and dies 0 to 5 feet. Um, I'll show you on my phone real quick. Uh, they got a ton of colors. You want to see that? This is all the colors they have. Um, it even keeps going after that. So... You guys can see there's ton, tons and tons of colors that they have. Um, pretty much any type of forge that you have in your lake, you can match it. Um, and you can also go with kind of stuff like this, like chartreuse, um, some dirtier water, and it's got it's got a wider body for the more erratic action. Um, and they have tons of different models. I mean, there's probably like 20 different ones. I'm pretty sure there's a couple lipless cranks, some thinner ones, some wider ones, some square bills, some round bills, some deep divers. Uh, I mean, Thunder Shad's got it all. Yeah, real great stuff. Um, pumped to throw this out there. Uh, looks pretty sweet. Um, let's see. What else? So you want to get some close-ups of that. Uh, this one is just chartreuse. It's got the kill dot on it is what they call it sometimes. You got the two eyes and the gill plate highlighted in red. Uh, I'll be throwing this in stained water. Uh, when the water's warming right now, the water's too cold to be throwing these kind of wider wider, more erratic um, crankbaits, square bills and coffin bills and stuff. But as the water warms, maybe some post spawn, post spawn, and during the fall is when these things really shine. Uh, the square bill models that go zero to five. Um, great looking crankbaits. They got, like I've been saying, they got some great stuff on the market, Thunder Shad does. And also, so does Fish Hound. Um, Fish Hound will have this available. They're, they're getting a lot of new stuff. They got some good rods. Uh, I don't know. I can't remember what brand of rods they have, but uh, I saw them the other day. They're real expensive rods. You can get them real cheap if you sign up. Um, they're starting to get rods. They're starting to get reels. starting to get high-quality crankbaits. They're starting to get some uh, soft plastics that are really good, and uh, they're really starting to step it up, and it's starting to get good. So if you guys haven't checked out Fish Hound, definitely go check them out. And if you haven't checked out... Uh, Thunder Shad, definitely go check them out too. They got all the all the best balsa wood crankbaits there is. So uh, that's my review over the uh, Thunder Shad um, Model 185 coffin coffin bill square bill crankbait. Um, and thanks for watching this.